today's defense of the Giza Class AA State Championship remains intact as the Blue Thunder took a thrilling win last week over Piedmont Academy. Now Memorial looks for a little bit of revenge for a regular season loss against Edmund Burke Academy. This week, senior A.J. Welch told me that during last year's run to a state title, Memorial played as if it had something to prove. The Blue Thunder certainly will feel as though they have to prove to Edmund Burke who is the better team. In a 21-7 loss last month, not only did Memorial lose all-around weapon Shad Wright to a season-ending leg injury, the Blue Thunder also turned the ball over six times, something that cannot happen regardless of who you're playing. I look for Memorial to play smarter, mistake-free football Friday night. The Blue Thunder will also have to slow down a Spartan offense led by running back Michael Taylor and a play-action pass that will look to tight end slash receiver Alex Sturkey. What a great name, Sturkey. The, par the Spartans will look to control the clock and it will be imperative for the Blue Thunder defense to keep the Spartans out of an offensive rhythm. This week I asked Memorial coach Michael Thompson what his team has to do to keep Edmund Burke from delivering the Blue Thunder another loss. So I was going out there and playing our keys, just playing physical up front, playing our assignment, making sure we, we stay focused and just go out there and play physical and play, go out there and have fun. Just the fact that you guys are the defending state champions, you've been in this position before, does that give you guys any kind of advantage going into Friday night? Yes, it does, but we still got to go out there, keep one thing in mind, take Friday night as one game, and then worry about what's going to happen on Friday night. Now, you have to give Edmund Burke credit. They beat Memorial a few weeks ago. The Blue Thunder didn't play its best game, and the Spartans took advantage. That said, I can't see Memorial giving up six turnovers again. That's very out of character for the defending champions. Well, I also think it'll do them good. Those miscues will keep the Blue Thunder focused and hungry. I see Memorial returning to the state title game and doing so with a 28-14 victory.